A team at Lawrence Livermore National Lab, National Ignition Facility, made the following happen. There's a tiny cylinder here at the end of this that you probably can't see. It's about so tall and this wide. Inside that was a, a small spherical capsule about half the diameter of a BB. 192 laser beams entered from the two ends of the cylinder and struck the inner wall. They didn't strike the capsule. They struck the inner wall of this cylinder and deposited energy. And that happened in less time than it takes light to move 10 feet, so it's kind of fast. X-rays from the wall impinged on the spherical capsule. Fusion fuel in the capsule got squeezed. Fusion reactions started. This had all happened before, 100 times before. But last week, for the first time, they designed this experiment so that the fusion fuel stayed hot enough, dense enough, and round enough for long enough that it ignited and it produced more energies than the lasers had deposited. About two megajoules in, about three megajoules out, a gain of 1.5. The energy production took less time than it takes light to travel one inch. Kind of fast. So this is pretty cool. Um, I have a special message to listeners who want to work on exciting, challenging, and important problems. We're hiring. <laughs>